In our crime and safety report now, inflation has made life more difficult for most people. The stress of high prices are adding to the financial burden for the average family. But it's also contributing to something else, an increase in hard drug use. WSAB's Joseph Leonard spoke with a local doctor about this trend. He joins us now to explain. Well, so problem is rearing its head again, but this time it's related to inflation. A local doctor tells me that in Chatham County, substance abuse is again on the rise. I've had patients flat out tell me now is a great time to do this because I don't have the resources to have fun in any other way. And this is the only thing I can do to make myself feel better. Dr. Connolly says during the pandemic, substance abuse became more common. Back then, people were isolated from friends and family, which led them to experiment with drugs. And now, three years later, Connolly says more patients are struggling with addiction. Now that inflation is going up, in some areas of our community, Drugs is less expensive than going out to a nice restaurant, sometimes going out and having a good time. So we're now seeing an increase in people that are having complications of substance use disorder. Michael Sarhat, Chatham County's counter narcotics team director, agrees. He says the county has also seen a significant rise in overdose deaths. In February's county commission meeting, Sarhat pointed out that deadly opioid overdoses rose by 20% in 2022. Dr. Connolly and Sarhat say the unpredictability of buying drugs from street dealers can be deadly. 80% of the pills on the street that you don't go to a, f a pharmacist and you have your, you get it straight from them, 80% of those are laced with fentanyl. So now oftentimes when they can't get it from a physician because there aren't enough, they're going to street medicine, which is very dangerous now that it's been shown to be laced with all kinds of things. Dr. Connolly says the patients he's seeing range in age, background and socioeconomic status. Substance use disorder can affect anyone. It can affect a, a college student, a high school student. It can affect somebody in their 80s and 90s. I've seen 90 year olds sometimes turn to substances. Now, WSV did a deep dive into the opioid crisis and how it's impacting our community. To learn more about the growing drug crisis, you can watch that full special called What Your Family Should Know About Opioids at WSV.com slash opioids. Joseph Leonard, WSV News 3, on your side.